Okay, so good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to today's session. Today we are talking matters health. Uh, we are talking about men's health, and more importantly, we are talking about prostate health. But uh, generally, we are discussing uh, fertility for men. And uh, you cannot discuss fertility for men without talking about the healthy, uh, healthy prostate. And uh, you cannot talk about prostate without talking about um, the other main fertility factors or the other main issues. And uh, <clears throat> you're going to get right down to it. My name is Fred Gishuki. Fred is an entrepreneur in the wellness industry. I've been in this industry for more than 20 years. I joined because of money. I wanted money, money, money. That was my focus. But when I came in, I discovered health. And I discovered that you can actually that health is more important than money. And um, the first benefit, like I always say, that I got from this industry was health. Uh, my dad had ulcers, my mom had high blood pressure. They used the products of Neolife and we were able to sort those issues out. Uh, more than 20 years later, they don't complain about pressure or uh, ulcers. My dad later developed a swollen prostate. So this topic is very close to me because we lived it as a family. Uh, my dad developed a swollen prostate and it was a very painful ordeal for him. It was very embarrassing. And uh, many a times um, he would feel like going for a short call, uh, rush to the toilet, nothing happens, comes back, sits down, the urine comes out and it was quite embarrassing. And it was an, an antisocial kind of situation because he now avoided many social gatherings because of those problems with the short call. But thanks to Neolife products, thanks to the program I'm going to share with you, uh, we were able to sort out his prostate issues without surgery. Uh, he only used medication from the doctor. He was prescribed on, ta on uh, tablets. I advised him not to take, not to go for surgery because I knew that with his advanced age, he's 85 years now, by then he was about <clears throat> maybe 79 or thereabouts. I knew that um, if he went in for surgery, chances of making it would be slim. So um, I told him, no, don't go for surgery. Just use the Neolife life products and ask the doctor to give you medicine. And that sorted him out. So today he lives a normal life. And um, it's amazing. So for me, this topic... Like I said, it's personal because I've gone through it um, through my dad. And I feel that it's important for men out there to really be aware um, of the fertility issues that concern men and really be proactive so that you can avoid uh, getting prostate problems and other fertility problems that men get. So um, getting into it, um, Why preventative health care for men matters? Now, research has shown that uh, men live an average of between five to seven years less than women. And um, this is because men don't really focus on pre preventative care as much as women. I think women, because of giving birth, um, they tend to really take care of themselves and um, actually prone to visits to the doctor when they feel there's a challenge. Now, I hope my screen is visible. I hope that my screen is moving. Uh, maybe I can get, um, I can get somebody just giving me a heads up that my screen is moving. Or if there's a problem, you can text, you can actually send a, a chat and say whether the screen is moving and whether the screen is okay. Um, so, uh, so preventative, Care only helps you to avoid, not only helps you to avoid health problems, um, but it helps you to save money in the long run. Kathy, am I okay? Is my screen moving? Yes, yes it is. Yes, that is it, Fred. Thank you so much. Okay. So we are saying that it's important for men to go for preventative health care. Men, we have a challenge. We only go to the doctor when we are on the last on our last legs, as in, you'll hardly find a man going to hospital unless he's really, really badly off. And here we are being told that not going to the doctor for a checkup 
is not good for our health, that if you want to live uh, as long as our female counterparts, then we need to go to the doctor for checkups frequently. Um, and that, I know I'm guilty of that, and most men are guilty of it. One of the things about the prostate is that you have to go for your PSI. And um, many men don't do it. And uh, that by the time they are doing it, they already have problems with their prostate. Now, these are some statistics that are quite a bit scary uh, where men are concerned. Um, men have a higher death rate. Men have a higher death rate uh, for most leading causes of death, including cancer, heart disease, diabetes, and suicide. And that just points us out to our weaknesses. Um, because of lack of taking care of our health, then we end up dying off faster than our women folk. And uh, even issues of suicide. And this suicide is basically, I think one of the reasons is uh, women, when they are stressed, they cry, they share with their friends, any problem they have, they, they are quick to open up. But men don't share. They keep it in their hearts and they end up harming themselves. Uh, so when you share a problem, it's therapeutic. When you cry, it's therapeutic. But men will hardly cry because they feel that crying is um, for women, not for men. Um, and you see, at the end of the day, it actually leads to some disastrous results. So um, we are saying here that we need to change some of our ways as men and embrace some of these practices which might help us to live a longer, healthier life. Now, approximately 30,000 men in the U.S. die each year from prostate cancer. That is scary, you know. And then it says here, one in two men will develop cancer. Yeah. As in out of every two men, one will develop cancer. Now, for the men on the call, that's a big challenge right there. It means that I need to take care of myself. I need to take care of my health. Uh, so that I may not develop cancer. If one out of two men is developing cancer, then it means that the one who won't develop is the one who will be proactive uh, and will put into practice some of the tips and um, ideas that I'm going to share on this particular platform. Now, men make half as many physician visits for prevention as women. We've talked about that. Men are more likely to be uninsured than women. Now, you'll find that even as uh, we do the business, as we deal with Neolife, a man will quickly buy supplements for the wife, uh, but he won't take them himself. Um, I remember a couple who came to me and they were struggling with uh, getting children. And uh, the guy said, well, I'll, take, I'll only take these things if I can swallow them with alcohol. Um, well, I quickly knew that it was a way of putting me off, telling me that he's not going to swallow these things. I told him, go ahead, go right ahead, swallow them with alcohol, because this is food, this is not medicine. And uh, it's amazing that uh, they bought the, the products, they went, started using them, and within a month, they actually conceived. Um, the girl got pregnant, she was so, so excited. Yeah, But that's just an example of men being reluctant to even swallow a supplement that he knows he needs uh, for his general health. Now let's move on here. Let's look at some of the challenges that men have. Um, and many of these challenges come about because of various lifestyle conditions our, um, and also because of um, um, having a prostate that is swelling. Because after the age of 30, you find that the prostate starts swelling. And you're going to look at why does the prostate swell. But some of the challenges that men get as a, are as a result of a swollen prostate. And many of them are unaware that they have a swollen prostate. And um, I always say that you can actually do a self-test to know that you have a swollen prostate. If you go for a short call and you find that you are trying to push urine and it's not coming out, or if the jet of urine was going a certain distance, now it's not going, and you're struggling. I see when you go to the urinal, some men are struggling to just pass urine. 
and they have to push. And uh, that means that your prostate is swollen because when the prostate swells, it pressed on, uh, onto the urinary tract and um, it's not easy to pass urine. Sometimes you may pass urine and there's blood in it, or you might just get a small dribble out. And then when you go sit down again, again, you feel like urinating. Sometimes the urine comes at odd hours. I know the other day we saw one of our presidents in, it, in Africa who was in a public gathering and suddenly he peed on himself. That is what um, a swollen prostate can do for you. So some of the challenges that will happen if you have a swollen prostate, definitely you will have low libido. That's a fact. Um, I remember my dad sat me down and told me, Fred, you know, you're my son, but I'm going to tell you this. Issues of the bedroom, I forgot them a long time ago because of the situation that I'm in. So uh, your libido will definitely go down. You will lose interest in the matters of the bedroom. Uh, if you have a swollen prostate. Um, some of the other causative factors for men challenges for fertility will be stress, fatigue. Um, if you're so fatigued, then definitely um, you'll have a problem that direction. Lifestyle conditions, for example, diabetes. When you're on diabetes, um, the medicine for diabetes and high blood pressure, then you may not be able to function as a man. Uh, low sperm count, um, weak sperms, uh, erectile dysfunction, uh, premature ejaculation, uh, impotence, infertility, and uh, last but not least, uh, prostate cancer. Uh, these are some of the challenges that actually come um, to men on matters uh, dealing with male fertility. Now. What are some of the causes for this? Why will somebody develop a swollen prostate? What happens? I remember when I saw the diagnosis for my dad, it was written a long-term deficiency of zinc, a long-term deficiency of zinc. My dad has been a smoker for more than 50 years. So um, when you smoke, smoking um, prevents the body from absorbing um, minerals from the food that you're taking. So uh, what happened is that um, you basically get zinc from the vegetables which have a strong taste, which are a bit bitter. We are talking about the kundes, the merendas, the, um, I know you know the bitter, the vegetables which are quite bitter. The more bitter it is, the more zinc it has. So if you are taking that and you're smoking, smoking blocks the body from absorbing the minerals from that, and that is zinc. So um, if you smoke, definitely you will prevent yourself from getting zinc from the diet. And uh, just like my dad, you might end up with a swollen prostate. Now, but other things that might cause problems in that area, sexually transmitted diseases that were not taken care of, like syphilis, gonorrhea, chlamydia, and the like. Um, hormonal imbalance, progesterone and testosterone uh, being imbalanced. Now, one of the main causes of a swollen prostate is actually hormonal imbalance. And uh, that is why it is not advisable to go under the cut. If you can manage it with supplements, um, then it is better because even if you go under the cut, it does reoccur again. And when it reoccurs again, um, and that time you, you, are, uh, you have advanced in age, it comes in very aggressively and going again under the cut might actually cost you your life. So it is better to try and manage it with medicine, of course, from the doctor and supplements so that um, you don't have to go under the cut. But better still, it is better to start protecting yourself from getting uh, a swollen prostrate uh, using supplements in advance. And that is my prayer for all the men on the call. Don't wait until you start getting prostate problems. Uh, you see, um, a man functions as a man. And um, if you're married, definitely you're sexually active. And, uh, and all that. And that means that you're actually using every part of your body. So it makes sense to then take care of that part of your body, your reproductive system, 
so that it functions properly. It is like driving a car. You cannot keep driving a car and you don't do service on that car. You don't check the oil. You don't pour the oil out. You don't put new brake, uh, new brake pads um, and all that. You cannot do that. And you cannot expect that car to continue functioning at peak levels if you don't service that car. So the same thing for men, and uh, I use the, the car because that is, men will understand that. Um, you need to get oil, you need to take care of your reproductive system uh, so that it can give you the service and it can function the way you want it to function. So uh, for the case of uh, imbalanced hormones, uh, I'm going to give you a solution for that. Being overweight will also have a problem. It will have a bearing on, on your reproductive system. Um, bad diet uh, that has excess cholesterol and carcinogenic foods. Now, when I talk about bad diet and I'm talking about men, definitely it's not chips uh, for most men, but it is nyamachoma, uh, it is alcohol, uh, it is going without meals. Uh, it's basically mistreating yourself. You find that a man might skip breakfast, skip lunch, and maybe have supper, and that day is gone. I mean, he's been operating on zero the whole day. Then he takes too much food when he doesn't need it, when he's going to bed. Um, and that definitely, you will not function properly as a man. If you're spending the whole day on an empty tank, and then you're eating a huge supper, that doesn't help you. In fact, that puts, makes you prone to getting diabetes, because now you put too much sugar in the system, when you're going to bed, when you're not going to be able to burn it, yeah? So we need to look at the way we are eating our foods, the types of foods that we are eating. Uh, we need to cut down on the nyamachomas and the like, yeah? Autoimmune disorders cause the body's immune system to attack the normal body, body tissues uh, that it would normally ignore. And we are talking about lupus, Hashimoto, thyroiditis, and rheumatoid arthritis, yeah? Chronic health problems, um, um, we talked about that, um, high blood pressure, diabetes, the like, arthritis, lifestyle choices, for example, smoking, alcohol, and drugs, we've talked about that. Um, drugs are funny, drugs, at the beginning, drugs give you, uh, uh, they increase your libido, but then as you keep on doing it, they now start working the other way around, and they start diminishing it, and before you know it, you cannot function. If you are prone to getting things like uh, Viagra, Viagra stresses your heart um, and you find that at the end of the day, you become hooked on it. You can't function unless you take it. And with time, you might get yourself um, into a heart attack or heart problems. So you realize that use of drugs, um, and they call them what? They call uh, the stimulants. Uh, Mira, for example, these are things that will be, at the beginning, they lie to you. You feel like you're feeling your libido is up, but after a while, it starts working the other way around. And finally, you find that you are hooked on it and you cannot function without it. Now, being exposed to toxins, um, with this kind of lifestyle, definitely we are all exposed to toxins, which have a bearing to that. And then stress. Stress has a negative effect um, on our reproductive system. When a man is stressed, especially when he's broke, when he doesn't have enough money, it is very hard for him to function as a man. It's very hard for a man to function in the bedroom uh, when he's broke, when he doesn't have money, when he has a lot of problems, uh, either marital or even in, in life, at work, with the children and all that. Uh, then you find that he may not be able to function. But all these, uh, when you're too stressed, again, it lowers your immunity and many opportunistic diseases actually come in. So these are some of the causes um, that might actually uh, contribute uh, to um, problems in the area of the fertility system. Now, what are some natural solutions that you can use to sort out your prostate as well as your reproductive system as a man? The first thing is detoxify your body, very important. Um, um, you can imagine you, you are maybe 30 something, you are maybe 40 something, 50 something, and you've never done a detox. How much in the way of toxins are you carrying? If you've ever done a change of um, the pipes in a drainage, 
and you see the kind of waste that comes out of that pipe. Uh, then you you and that pipe has probably been there less for a less period than you have been around, and you've never done a detox system, a detox program. Then you can see the kind of waste you're carrying in your body. So doing a detox at least once a year is very very important. And we have a wonderful detox program in uh, Neo Life that actually cleanses your system. It cleanses your bloodstream. Uh, it cleanses your your digestive tract. Uh, it removes uh, toxins, uh, it, it cleanses your lymphatic system, uh, it also cleanses your gut um, and ensures that uh, there is no waste that remains in there. So we have a wonderful detox program and that's a topic for another day. Then have a healthy diet, we are going to talk about that. Uh, have restful sleep, um, exercise and manage your stress, very important. Have some me time, have some me time, very important. Uh, for men, having me time is important. I know uh, men usually like going to watch football, whether it's in, um, in, a, in I mean, in, in, a, in the stadium, some go to the pub to watch football, uh, but that's an example of me time. You need to have me time. You need to have some time where you sit, and you engage in an extracurriculum activity that, of course, that does not harm you because if you engage in drinking too much alcohol, then that will harm you. But we are saying do something like exercise, like jogging, like walking that uh, will, will relax you. Uh, read a book, a positive book or a functional book, whichever. Watch a movie. Uh, do something that manages your stress. Reduce or quit smoking and taking alcohol. Uh, use natural supplements and herbs. And that's where we come in as Neolife uh, because we give you some herbs and supplements that are natural and organic. And right there, we look at this gentleman, Jerry Brassfield, and uh, on whose vision we ride. Uh, Jerry Brassfield at 19 years of age had asthma. He used supplements, they worked for him. And he decided he was going to help other people get the same benefits from the same supplements. He partnered with Dr. Other Fast and the Scientific Advisory Board. And together they have created a whole list of natural and organic supplements that fine tune the body, that help the body to function the way God intended it to function. And the male reproductive system is not any different. We have products that are specific uh, for that part uh, of the of the male body. Now, um, there is a problem, and the problem is in our diet. If you look at the two pyramids, um, there's a lifestyle pyramid on your right, on your right, which is uh, on my right, which is your left. Um, and it says you need to have physical activity. You need to eat a lot of whole grains, a lot of fruits and vegetables, a lot of proteins. No minimal minimum proteins. And in fact, you normally say a quarter kilo should be taken by 12 men. This is just to bring this into perspective. And Dr. Fatma shared with us that if you take a quarter kilo of nyamachoma, you are similar to somebody who has smoked 64 cigarettes. Now, that, that shocked me. And um, you see, when you look at the way meat is roasted, it's put on, on, on charcoal. And what is charcoal? Charcoal is carbon monoxide. It's actually carbon monoxide. And when, when it is burned, that charcoal gets into the meat. Um, so, and then it, it takes a while to roast it. And then you sit and you eat. So the taste that you get from nyamachoma is actually that carbon that you are eating and putting in your system. And you can imagine a quarter kilo is the same as 64 cigarettes. So how much damage have you done to yourself by taking just a quarter kilo of meat? Now, what if you take it on a daily basis, yeah, or every weekend you're out and you're eating a kilo or, or thereabouts, then it means that you're actually damaging your body in a very big way. This knowledge is important because you have a choice. You can, there are many, uh, when you go to eat meat, you can decide to do nyamcho, boiro, you can boil the meat, you can, you can fry the meat, you can do different ways. And there, right there, you see that um, taking nyamachoma or roasted meat should be done occasionally. And that also applies to uh, roasted maize. You still get the carbon coming in 
if you're going to eat roasted maize continuously, then you are getting too much carbon into your body. Then fats and sugars, you need to minimize um, fats and sugars. Uh, they say you take a teaspoon a day. I can see somebody is getting excited and writing on my chat. Please desist from writing on the chat. So a teaspoon of sugar, a teaspoon of fat is good enough for the day. But is that the way we eat? No, we eat the other way around. A lot of fats and sugars, a lot of proteins, very little in the way of fruits and vegetables. We eat whole grains when we cannot avoid. We rarely eat them nowadays. And when you're eating the other way around, then you get all manner of problems that come into the body. Uh, because you find that at the end of the day, you start getting uh, fatigued. Um, you stop functioning properly as a man. Um, your libido goes down because you're tired all the time. You're always tired. Uh, your, your, your cells are not functioning properly. Um, and and you, you start getting other diseases that come in. You get too much cholesterol in your system um, and you become overweight and that kind of thing. So what is the solution here? Solution number one, TNN. TNN is amazing. TNN is an amazing, amazing product. And I think it's tomorrow we are having a, a seminar on TNN, which you just cannot afford to miss. Um, I know the link is somewhere and it will be shared again. Um, they are talking about the cellular revolution. So tomorrow be there. I think it's happening. Is it seven o'clock or eight o'clock our time? So that will be exciting. But what does TNN do? TNN helps to feed the cells. Um, TNN increases uh, cellular energy production. It optimizes membrane function. What is TNN made of? It is made from the germ of wheat, rice, and soya. And um, if you're not taking TNN, if you're not getting in whole grains, you find that your cell membrane becomes very tough and impermeable. Nutrients are not able to get in. Waste is not able to get out. Toxins accumulate. This leads to fatigue and you're always tired for some reason. But now when you take in TNN, you convert that cell to a healthy cell. So nutrients are able to get in, waste is able to get out, and you find that you become extremely energetic. Now, this product by itself, I've given it to men who have been complaining of not performing in the bedroom. And um, I tell them, okay, fine, this is a program. I give them the program. And I, they say they don't have money. I tell them, okay, fine, just start with three and then, and then you'll get the rest later. And the guy comes back and tells me, now I'm functioning the way I used to function. And basically the thing is, uh, his cells were tired. He was so fatigued, uh, he could not function at all. But after he sorted out his cells, then now he's able to function the way uh, he was supposed to function as a man. Um, so TNN, yesterday I was in a meeting uh, and uh, there was a gentleman that I had seen a while back. He came to one of our seminars and he was so down and um, he had uh, issues, low blood count and that kind of thing. He could not function as a man. Um, and I shared with him, um, I mean, he came, he attended our meeting. He bought uh, TNN about two weeks ago. And today the gentleman is so strong. He's, I mean, he's, he's even gained weight. He's quite energetic. And uh, he didn't talk to me about bedroom issues. So I assume that he's functioning better because the first time when we, we had a session, he called me later and he was asking me, so is there a solution for me because I'm not able to function in the bedroom? So 3NN is amazing. So start with 3NN. Second product is carotenoid complex. Carotenoid is made from a uh, hundred, it's similar, taking 90 tablets is similar to taking 115 kilos of raw fresh fruits and vegetables. And it has about 18 different types of fruits and vegetables in that bottle. If you take it for 20 days, it gives you, it boosts your immunity by 37% above normal. And this helps to protect you from disease. This is the product that will prevent you from getting prostate cancer, yeah? Uh, we all have cancer ourselves, by the way, but your immunity is what determines whether you're going to get the cancer or you won't get the cancer. And when you take carotenoid complex, then you are able to ensure that you don't develop the cancer. Now, then we have omega-3 salmon oil plus. Now, if there's a product that is so critical for men, it is this one. 
Um, you see, one thing about omega-3 salmon and our omega-3 salmon, because our omega-3 salmon has the eight members of the omega-3 families, and they are listed right there uh, on your screen. Uh, because I know some people will say, oh, you talked about omega-3, so they'll pop into the nearest pharmacy and buy an omega-3 uh, product. I discourage you from doing that for some reasons. The first reason is that you'll probably get just one of the omega-3 oils in that product. Um, and that's why it is way cheap because it only gives you one and you will not get the benefits that you're looking for um, from our omega-3. And the other thing is that, the other reason I would discourage you is that some of the products that talk about having omega-3, the omega-3 is only available on the label. It's just there on the label, but inside it is something totally different. So you have to be very careful. I remember one time one of the leaders from South Africa came to Kenya and uh, she did an experiment. She went to the chemist, bought a product that was stating that it has omega-3 in it. And uh, she picked two plastic um, glasses um, and the ones that we use for taking water. And she blistered the omega-3 from the chemist, which was purportedly full of rich omega-3. And she just squeezed it into one cup and she squeezed our omega-3 in another cup. And she continued with her presentation. About 45 minutes later, she went back and picked up the cup that had the omega-3 from the pharmacy. And the omega-3 from the pharmacy had chewed a hole into the plastic of that cup. I mean, we were so shocked. Um, we were so shocked by that experiment, which tells you that some of these things that they say have omega-3 are actually lethal uh, to your life. They are not good for your life. So what does omega-3 do for the male reproductive system? Number one, it replicates the reproductive system. It lubricates the prostate. For the prostate to function properly, you need a lot of omega-3 oils. You also need zinc. Those two things combined together will ensure that your prostate is moist and your prostate won't swell. When you take salmon for uh, 60 days, it lowers inflammation in your body by 68%. So we are talking about a swollen prostate. So if you take omega-3 salmon, it means that in two months time, you will reduce the amount of swelling of that prostate by 68%. Now you can see why I was saying that if you're on supplements, you may not need to actually uh, go in for surgery for the prostate because the supplements themselves can actually ensure that your, your prostate is healthy. So uh, bottom line, we need to take omega-3 oils. And like I said, omega-3 oils will prevent you from getting a swollen prostate in the first place. Now, salmon, uh, omega-3 salmon, another thing about it is that it increases your sperm count. Uh, so you find that uh, for those who are trying to get children, um, you'll actually be able to boost uh, the production of sperms um, by using omega-3 salmon. And that is why I can tell you I've given it to several men who are struggling to get children and they're able to get their partners to conceive. So it's an amazing, amazing uh, product. I always like saying it gives the men the bullets to actually uh, do the job that they're supposed to do. Then you have multivitamin and minerals, very, very important. There are several essential minerals uh, that you need in the body to function properly. And zinc is one of them, and you're going to get into that uh, shortly. Uh, but that is available right there. And when you combine that, it comes in the form of pro-vitality pack. So we are talking about trianem, carotenoid, uh, omega-3 salmon, and the multi. And it's all in a pack. And I can tell you one thing about this pack. This pack is just amazing. I remember giving it to a certain gentleman, um, very senior in government. And this guy was having problems sleeping, and uh, he was a bit advanced in age. And um, he wasn't really, okay, he didn't tell me whether he was functioning in the bedroom or not, but uh, he was complaining of fatigue and uh, insomnia. He could not sleep at night. And after he took this product, the result that I got was quite amazing. He asked me, Fred, 
do those things of yours have steroids? I mean, I'm so energetic. I'm, I'm A. Even my wife is complaining that I'm too energetic. And I at once realized that this guy must have slowed down at some point and he was not functioning. And now that he was on provitality, he was back. And the wife was wondering, hey, uh, things that were happening once a month or once in three months are now happening every week. So I think it, it, it's just an amazing product. Uh, provitality will give you energy. It will actually help you to function. And remember, our products are all natural and organic. There is nothing steroid about it. Uh, they, are, they are healthy products. They are made from the food that we are, we are supposed to be eating, but we are not eating. So that's ProVitality Plus, and that forms the basis uh, for the fertility program for men. Now, the next products are now more specific. Um, the first one is Masculine Herbal Complex. I mentioned earlier that... Um, Swelling of the prostate is a hormonal issue in most cases, and it's also a, an issue to do with uh, nutrition as well. So um, you need to take masculine herbal complex at least once every six months. And what does that do is it balances out the hormones in your body as a man. So that ensures that your prostate uh, remains healthy. Yeah. And as you can see there, it helps men regain renewed energy and physical vitality. That is pro uh, masculine herbal. It actually boosts libido. Uh, it's very safe, very natural. And instead of taking Viagra, this is what you should actually take. And for the women, uh, masculine herbal has what we call celery seeds. And celery seeds help the man feel like spending more time with the wife. So if you want your man to hang around the, the, the house, uh, if you want to spend more time with him, if you want to go shopping with a guy, buy him masculine herbal, and suddenly the guy will be hanging around in the house, especially if he's going out too much. Get him masculine herbal, and you'll find that he'll become a very good husband. Now, the next product that uh, is important for us is uh, zinc. Zinc is very, very important for men. I've mentioned zinc severally since I started talking, and it actually supports prostate health. And um, our zinc is just amazing. It's a hundred tablets, and zinc helps you to function as a man. And um, I remember having a situation whereby there's this gentleman, friend of mine, uh, who had just gotten married, and he was not very exposed in the matters um, of the bedroom. And he had a problem. He was not staying more than a minute. Uh, when they went to the bedroom, uh, within a minute or two, he's done. And, um, and the wife was getting very frustrated. Uh, he would get excited and uh, really um, get finished before he starts. And um, he came to me and he told me, Fred, I have a problem. Uh, we were close, so he could open up to me. And he told me this and this is happening. And I told him not to worry. I have the solution just for you. So I gave him zinc and uh, masculine herbal uh, and omega-3. Uh, that time we didn't have uh, three and then we had formula four. And uh, the story is so interesting because suddenly uh, the young man was not uh, getting finished. He was he was lasting longer and longer and longer. And it reached a point whereby the wife was saying, okay, fine, you have to reduce the amount of supplements you are taking because every day I walk into this house, I'm in trouble. And uh, they started negotiating and he was taking two tablets of masculine herbal every day. And the wife said, no, you'll only be taking one. Then after a while, she said, no, you'll not even take that one. You'll be taking half. And after a while, he could only take one tablet once a week. And uh, after that, the wife had to take over the masculine hub and keep it in hand under lock and key. So the young man um, sorted out his problem. So if there's a man out there who has a problem in that direction, we have a solution. You don't need to go for chemicals. Don't go for those artificial stimulants that will harm you and strain your heart and make you to get palpitations and high blood pressure and all those heart failure. I know several Waishimiwas who have passed on uh, because of taking these products. In fact, one of them, I won't mention his name, 
was my customer. And I was applying him with masculine herbal and zinc and omega-3. And he was doing so well in matters of the bedroom. But then he became wise and uh, he stopped buying from me and he went back to the blue pill. Before I started supplying him, he was using the blue pill. And I remember him telling me that um, when you take the blue pill, that is Viagra, he actually could see his jacket pumping out. His heart was, was like it wanted to come out uh, because of Viagra. Um, and he was so thankful that our products were, didn't have that kind of effect. But I don't know for what reason he decided to go back to the Viagra thing. And that actually, uh, he had also other complications, high blood pressure, diabetes, and he passed on, unfortunately. So you don't need to go that direction. We have a solution. Masculine herbal zinc, omega-3 will sort you out. Now, another product is a Cruciferous Plus. Now, Cruciferous vegetables are important. Uh, what cruciferous does is that it settles on receptor sites. And uh, what are cruciferous vegetables? They are the vegetables that when you cut, they have a cross. You're talking about cabbages, broccoli. Uh, the vegetables that when you cut, they have a cross. They crucify cancer in the real sense of the word. And they did a test one time. They took uh, raw broccoli. They crushed it, produced juice, and... Uh, put it, uh, poured it on a breast specimen with cancer under a microscope, and they could see the breasts, the, the 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 juice from broccoli eating out the cancer cells. That's how serious cruciferous vegetables are. So you should be eating a lot of cruciferous vegetables, but you should also supplement with cruciferous plus, which will help you to prevent yourself from getting uh, prostate cancer. And also for breast cancer, any kind of hormonal cancers, um, cervical cysts, um, uh, fibroids, and all that, you need cruciferous plus for the ladies, that is. Last but not least, we have uh, aloe vera plus. Aloe vera plus is good for stress. It helps you to manage stress. It's very luxurious. It's a nice drink, very yummy. Uh, it cuts hangover like, and like anything. Uh, it's friendly to your liver, your kidney, your pancreas. I mean, you just need, whatever it touches, it heals. And for men who especially love taking kanyuaji, then you need a lot of aloe vera plants. This is something that you should have in the house. And every day when you come home, you just take a thought and you function uh, very well as a man. So that's it on men. But remember, your health is your wealth. If you lose your health, you can lose everything, exercise regularly, sleep well, and um, eat uh, a healthy diet. If you listen to your body when it whispers, you won't have to hear it uh, scream. Okay. Then we don't just deal with matters, prostate matters, men fertility. We have so many other solutions in terms of arthritis, in terms of stress management, sharper mind, weight management, heart health, energy and fitness, uh, boosting your immunity, managing sugar levels, reproductive health for both men and women. We have some excellent home care products, some excellent skin care products. We have a product for farming called Super Grow that doubles your crop production. I know men love farming. Super Grow is just amazing. You, you spray it on your crops and you're harvesting five bags after spring Super Grow. Whether you use fertilizer or not, you get two to three times what you are getting before. And that's just amazing. So these are some of the other interventions that are there. But I must also mention that this is a business opportunity that you can do and that can actually make a positive difference in your life as well as the lives of your family. I can tell you, like for me, I came in because of money. I did it. Uh, I started making money from your life. Uh, by age 30, I had quit employment to do this on a full-time basis. It has made a very big difference in my life, the health of my family, uh, being able to travel abroad, and so many benefits. But today, it's not my day. Um, we have a gentleman that I truly respect. Uh, this is one of the pioneers of New Life in Kenya, and he's a man who has used these products. I mean, when you look at him and he tells you his age, you cannot believe it. I mean, it just I say, when I grow up, I want to be like him. And he's so physically fit. I remember uh, when they went to the Windsor Golf and Country Club, he was always 
uh, he was always beating everybody uh, on the field in terms of moving. He was moving so fast. The only person who could beat him was Eric Otier. But he was, I mean, he was right up there when he went to play football at some point. And the guy was performing so well, it was just amazing. And he's a true epitome of what taking these products can, can do to you. So without further ado, I want to invite Job Karanja. Job, are you there? Yes, I am. Fantastic, fantastic. You can take it away, Job. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you very well. Can you see me? No, I can't see you, but I can hear you. Now I can see you. Ah, okay. Uh, good evening, everyone. And my name is uh, Fred has said, I'm Job Karanja. I have been in this business for as long as Fred has been there. If we were to give a story about our journey with Fred, uh, we can talk until tomorrow. But uh, that is a story for another day. Job is married to Anne. Actually, Anne is the one who brought the business home. At that time, I was working for uh, a company where I worked for almost 20 years. And at that point, I had developed very serious sinus. And uh, I had also had issues with my leg, my back, and my arm through an accident about 15 years before then, because that was 96. And uh, I had had an a serious accident in Nairobi, and which put me in Nairobi hospital for a whole month in the same position because there's no you can have a, a plaster the pelvic bone and the collarbone i actually lost my brother the one i follow in that accident so when my wife came with a business home i saw the product i didn't see the business because i had also started some side business uh, i did so many things supplies and other businesses after work. I even had my own uh, company. But as I was trying to help her in the business by using the product, I attended quite a number of meetings and uh, I didn't only get more information on the product, I also got uh, to learn more about the business. And as we speak now, I am not doing anything else much. Actually, it's my main business today. I do it from home now, it's not that it's online. Uh, these products have really changed my life. As I said earlier, I suffered for about 15 years from the accident until when the business was brought home. And I started using the product. Every time it was cold or I could drive in the jam, I had to go for physio or get massage and all these kind of things. But for the last almost 27 years now, since we joined the business from 96 to date, just like Fred said, correctly said, Twitza, we, whenever we went for the uh, morning walk and a sprint, the last kilometer was a sprint. Nobody could beat me except Eric. We went for the team building with Fred uh, not very long time ago. I think it was, must have been in March or April this year. And uh, same thing was happening. Why? Because of the usage of the product. That's why when people talk about the products being uh, expensive, I wonder what they are comparing them. Because if I suffered for 15 years and I had all the best medical, actually, the pipeline had a very good medical for us, the middle class and the upper uh, class in the, in, in the company. 
I was in Nairobi Hospital going for hydro, uh, physio, and getting the best education every time. But it didn't help much until I got the supplement. Today, I walk between five to 10 kilometers every other day, and I'm doing my exercises. And as far as age is concerned, I don't know how many of my age can do that. I'll be 69 later in the year, this year. Uh, between us with Anne, we have uh, three children who are now adults, because they is between 32 and 40. So you can see the benefits of using the product. The other thing that I have been able to benefit from uh, this business is you no, know, I retired early because I like my freedom. I left employment when I was, I think, 42. And I started doing so many other businesses. And at the end of it all, I was left with a lot of debt. But thank God, during that period is when um, new life came and I could do the other business together with the uh, new life. And uh, today, has anybody me to fear those debts? And I'm living a better life. Not many people who have retired are able to take care of themselves and are having, enjoying good health, having social capital, because that is what is killing most of the retired people. They could be having a lot of money, they could be having a bit of their health, but they are, well, majority of their uh, peers, the people of their age, either they are down very sick or they are dead or they themselves are sick. So I highly recommend that for the guests and even those people who are already in the business and are not 100% users of the, pro of the product, to do that because you really enjoy a very good uh, uh, life. The other benefit from uh, this business is you discover yourself. You know, there is this issue of the Me Too syndrome, especially the people in the offices. You are professional, so you think you can only do maybe consultancy in your line of profession, but it is not there. So you hear there is chicken being kept there, there's a friend of yours who is doing well, you try that. You try matatu, you try whatever. But when you understand what, 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 is, what this new life has to offer, you will realize that there's no any other business that, or opportunity that's better than this. You do it with the people you want to do it with. The time you want to, you allocate your own time. You have time freedom. It gives you money. gives you a, a very unique. Um, it is the, the kind of life that you live is unique, just like the business is unique. And that uniqueness is the issue that majority of the people have because they are not ready to understand it. I find people who come into the business for a short while and they quit. I don't blame them. Because for me, if I didn't have an issue in my health, maybe I would not be here today. Because I thought the other businesses were better. They were giving more money, quick money. Because you will go and sell a property and you make a lot of money. But before you realize you have finished that money, you have not sold another one, and you are already in debt. And because the banks are very good, they make money uh, by lending, they will lend you, they'll give you even credit cards. Before you realize you are in a lot of problems, but with a new life, you need to understand that you start small and grow it. As you grow old, the business also grows. Now I am approaching 70, but I'm getting more, much more money than I used to get even when I was employed.
or even from the other business. Because you make a lot of money and then maybe the users. By the end of the year, you have debts. Yeah, not anything that you have saved. But with this, you have a golden opportunity here, which is holistic. You get your health, you get lifestyle, you get uh, social capital, as I said. Very good friends, positive friends, people you can rely on, people who will always be giving you hope and giving other people hope. If I look at the future of you know, my, what is for me in your life, I don't know even how to explain it. Because every day I find things becoming better. Every day, every day. Because I meet new people who join our business, people who need uh, to be assisted, or be helped in one way or the other. People don't have jobs, people don't are suffering from uh, one disease or the other, and you have something to offer. Before then, I didn't have anything to offer because whatever I was doing, if it was, I could only do it myself. Or if it was applied, I could only do it myself. I couldn't even want somebody else to uh, to get to know exactly what I, you know, you, you cannot mentor somebody in this other business like you can do in this new life. And I look at maybe another one year, two years or by the next year when I'm 70, I'm just imagining, you know, continuing to play that football we were playing with a, a friend with my grandchildren. Today we play with them, we run around with them. That is the, the joy that any parent would want. Anybody, I'm sure, would like to be able to have the health and the money to be able to entertain the grandchildren, not looking for assistance from the children or even those grandchildren. But instead, you are the one who is, who is um, entertaining them. So they are happy coming home. Like now I have some of them here. They came for lunch. And they, they, they could not let me uh, come and lock myself in this room. <laughs> but I told them, no, it's just for a short while I'm joining you. They are downstairs. Just a short while ago, one of them was knocking at the door. Why? Because I'm able, I'm vibrant, I'm able to play around with them. Or courtesy of the new life product. So I would appeal to people, just what Fred has given us. And Fred, you have done a fantastic job. Because a lot of men, especially of our age, say from 40, uh, our age and, and beyond, they are all, maybe 90% are suffering in one way or the other from prostate. But as you correctly said, men don't talk about it. Very few. You need to be very close to them. Or maybe it becomes very serious that they cannot hide it anymore. That's when you will come to you realize or they will open up. And in most cases, it's not them, the doctors who will tell you. So let's go out and try to help as many people as we can. First, to understand what we have. This is not medicine. The food concentrates we have, those people confuse them. I have a team in the US, when they call me, they call me doctor, and they are always asking for medicine. I try to tell them, this is not medicine, it's food concentrates. Like I was talking to one just a short while ago, who had diabetes. And he said, yes, I know you are not, but I'm not calling you dog because for over 20 years I was suffering from diabetes. But, and I went, he went to the US with a diabetes over 10 years ago. He had suffered here for another 10 years. He is in the land where you have all the specialists, but still it was becoming worse. 
as it grows old. Only to take our supplements, and within two weeks, the sugar had stabilized. Now he has been taking uh, the, the supplements for, I think this is a bad man, and he's off insulin, and he's just taking one tablet. And the doctor told him, and he, he goes back, I think he's going for a review in, uh, in next week, that's what he was telling, so that he can stop taking medicine. So that is the power of our product. And if you can reach out to somebody and change their life positively, either financially or health-wise, or even giving him that social capital because there are people, who, a lot of people are lonely. No wonder there are people who they over drink, they do other things to try and, and you know, fill that gap, that emptiness. But the new life will give you that through the personal growth that you get and the, the training, like the fantastic training that we have been given by uh, Fred. I've learned few of the things that I, I wasn't very sure about, but now they are more clearer. Now I can even talk with more authority to some of my friends from the training that we have had now. So for the guests, join us and use the product. Be 100% personal use of the product. And also share the same with other people. And uh, for the distributors, let's not keep this information. Let's share it everywhere we go. And with that, I wish you all the best and have a good evening. God bless. Thank you so much, Job. Thank you so much for your testimony. I can even see so many people in the chat are very excited about it. And uh, that's just amazing. Uh, like you said, Job has a big team in the US. And um, he actually has a very big organization. And you've heard it. He said, the older you grow, the more money you make. That's just amazing. That's a kind of uh, business, the kind of life that you want to live. In the normal world, the older you grow, the less the money, the more, the more the frustrations, and nobody wants anything to do with you. But in your life, the older you grow, the more money you make. So... We've come to the end of our session. This recording will be available later tonight. Uh, so talk to the person who invited you to this call. They will be able to share it with you. Um, if, if, you are, if you are stranded, you can always go on YouTube, uh, on my YouTube page. It's at Fred Gishuki, and you can be able to get it there. Um, but otherwise, it was great chatting with you guys. Have a restful Sunday evening. Tomorrow we'll be having our usual business presentation, I believe. I think, I'm not sure whether we'll have the tree and then the, the business presentation, but definitely there'll be a meeting tomorrow and we'll talk about the business even as we talk about the product. So make a date, be there tomorrow. And if you're a guest and you want to know how to make money, uh, welcome tomorrow for that particular session. Otherwise, good night. God bless you. Thank you again, Job. Uh, for that um, fantastic presentation. Um, and sorry again for those who got the link very late. Um, we'll see you again next Sunday when we'll discuss a different um, part of, of health. I see somebody saying that tomorrow 7 p.m. is a TNN presentation. Then the, the training for, for the, the usual presentation will start at 8 o'clock. So just uh, keep that in mind. But otherwise, good night. God bless you. It was great chatting with you. See you again next Sunday. And bye. Good night. Good night.